Hello everybody and welcome back to Pokemon Black. In the last one, we did some Team Plasma, um, we battled some Team Plasma Grunts, and then we went to the basement. Uh, I don't think I healed any of my Pokemon. <laughs> no, I probably should do that. Don't I have revives in my bag? Let me look. I should have revives. See, look, plenty, see? Jasper's fine, look at her. She's healing nice. <laughs> and some Moo Moo Milk. Just, just pour that on her scales. She, see, look, she's fine now. Don't worry about it. <laughs> Alright. So now, we'll head upstairs. After this grunt. <laughs> okay, trainer, use Pokemon. Show me your strength. I will certainly try. I'm gonna lower this for my headphones. <laughs> this should be easy as shit. Surprisingly enough, I don't think Jasper got this. Oh no, we'll try, we'll try. Uh, Dig. Dig should do a lot of damage. We are holding the soft sand, right? Yeah, we are holding soft sand. Hell yeah. Jasper's got Moxie! Watch out, okay. Probably to dig again since so. It's pretty good. What is this? Uh, okay. Bro, I am so excited. I got two messages this morning. One saying my Mayship package was being shipped. Another one saying that my SMG4 plushie was getting shipped as well. <laughs> well, technically it's SMG3, but... Ooh, Sanji's level 29. <laughs> Electro Ball? Isn't he, like, super speedy? Who's Electro one? I believe, um, what the fuck is this thing name? Uh, Joltik is supposed to be a fast Pokemon, so this would be perfect. I see. Really? Oh shit! My bad. <laughs> I missed the ball on that one. All right. I believe Sanji is supposed to be a speedy, speedy boy, so... I believe there's... Oh. <laughs> I can't take two steps in this place! <laughs> Clink! Get out of here. I don't think this thing knows levitate. I think it's like plus and minus, right? Oh, thank god we avoided the electric attack. <laughs> Our crap Pokemon avoided it. There we go. Yes, for the goat. Let's see, I should probably put on... There we go. Yeah, there's some... Some trainers and items down here. Take this, the winning strategy I've developed. Well, I'll, I'll be the judge of that one if it is actually pretty good. Uh, what is his name? Corky? That's an interesting name. Jasper's not prepared for this fight. Mm. Mm. <laughs> I think we gotta go switch out. Cosmo got it. Cosmo is probably the weakest one. Well, actually, technically, Sanji is, but. Cus was not too far off. What the fuck did it do? Speed fell. Nah, it's fine. Air cutter. There you go. What? What? No, get get lost. Wait, I didn't know this thing could learn gust. 
out of here. Cosmo, I need you to not suck. <laughs> There we go. He did it. <laughs> what the fuck is this thing? Oh, it's a little turtle! Oh, that's that's not good, actually. Oh, that's really not good. <laughs> oh, shit. We're not very good at this game. No, little should take care of it in like one hit. It's a beautiful being. Let's go. I feel down. Yeah, I would feel bad too if someone killed my favorite Pokemon. All right. Yeah, there's an item. A magnet! Okay! Look at that to Sanji when he turns level 30. And then I believe there's a scientist over there, and then we get to, get to lead the cave. Crunch! Man, for not- Oh, that was crit, that's why. I was like, wow, for not being very effective, that did a lot of damage. There we go. Let's get out of here. A pair of wheels. Oh, I guess gears. So gears are more accurate because that's what it is. Wait, is Sanji level 30? Hold on. No, not yet. Okay. Alright, scientist man. Though we don't have to deal with this. I want to solve all the mysteries in the world. For that purpose, I will keep fighting. I also don't like completing my sentences. Ordville? Who came up with these names? <laughs> I'm gonna look in the credits and see like the the, the trainer namer. Cause there are choices. Get out of here. You're not gonna hit me. Jasper does not like getting hit on by gears. It's not her favorite. Get out of here. Look at that, Jasper's got Moxie. Oh, we're gonna lose. Mysteries only deepen. Now now he can complete his sentences. Let's actually revive Cosmo real quick. Alright, and then just just pour some moo moo milk on, on his wings. He should be fine. Let's see, perfect. All right. Oh. <laughs> I thought that meant the cutscene was happening. Get out of here. Leave. Leave. I don't want to deal with you. Go away. Many different values mixed together and the world becomes gray. That is unforgivable. I will separate Pokemon and people. And black and white will be clearly distinct. <gasps> he said the name of the title! <laughs> Only then will Pokemon become perfect beings. Yes, that is my dream. A dream that must be fulfilled. Phoenix, you have your own dream. I do. I hope to get 100 subscribers by the end of this year. So that's my dream. You have a dream. That's wonderful. I'll learn just what kind of dream you have in battle. I forgot how good his music is. I'm turning this shit up for me. I love Enz music. It's so good. I have it in my car <laughs> on my playlist. <laughs> Bulldor, okay. Wow, this is gonna be easy for Jasper.
I believe he uses the Pokemon that are in like the areas that you battle. So mostly these will be in Chargestone Cave. So this is gonna be the easiest site ever in the world. Oh. Desper didn't like that very much. Do you believe that people oh, should better help us better understand each other? Uh probably. Don't hit Jasper. Jasper doesn't like that. I actually might need to switch Jasper out soon. Do stick again. Cause that did a lot of damage. Get out of here. You can't bring Jasper any more down than she is. There we go. Get the bull door out of here. Joltik! Oh, you poor soul. Good thing we still have Rock Tomb. Oh, so close. God damn it. Uh. Jasper! What the hell, bro? Oh shit, we are not prepared for Joltik. <laughs> this should be fine, right? There we go. Okay, that's fine. I realize after I put Cosmo out, it's not weak against flying, so. Get 31 for Cosmo? 30 for Sanji. Oh god. You're not looking good here. Um. Calm mind, because <laughs> we're gonna need to calm our minds. Oh god. Don't hit him! He's sad! <laughs> uh, well, it flinched, so I guess I'll take that. Uh, air cutter. Oh man, poor Costa, he's dying. Oh. Shit, I don't know what to do. This little. No, I'll do it. Get out of here. Alright, now set up seven quiver dances. being annoying with this Pokemon. It's so nice. I actually was talking to a bunch of people about Pokemon Black and White, and I talked about how I, I love Lilliant and everything, and I love, like, the, the shitty, like, the, not the shitty moveset, like, the most annoying moveset I put on it. And, like, they were like, oh, that's actually a really good way to use Lilliant. That's really smart of you. I'm like, I know, right? I used 10% of my brain on that one. Alright, time for Giga Drain. Alright, next Pokemon's getting one shot. Pharaoh Seed, okay. I will show you my love for my friends, participants, and every uh, cell in my body. I think that's what he said. Me too, bro. Me too. Oh, wait, that didn't do much. Actually, sad. Yeah. 
Bro, you, you don't touch her. You're gonna ruin her dress. Get out of here. Yeah. I didn't know if he would have a Pharisee or like a temple. Not a temple. It's 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 the electric thing I can't pronounce. My friend's getting hurt. That's what a Pokemon battle is. I mean, technically he's not wrong. <laughs> technically he got a point there. Tch, why? Is it impossible for me to win while feeling bad about being a trainer? As if I pursue my ideals with something as meaningless as a battle. As if that could make me worthy of becoming friends with the legendary Pokemon. Phoenix! Bianca, I'm, t t t t I'm trying to chill with Anne right now. Just a little fruit to uh, Miss Strollinson City. Hi, Juniper. Bianca, you have good ears. I can't believe you heard Phoenix's voice from that far away. Boy, I do not talk in this game. What are you talking about? <laughs> Phoenix, who is this trainer? Um, he's he's hot. He's got green hair. <laughs> Professor Juniper, what were you thinking? You appear to have no qualms about the relationship between Pokemon and people. But Pokemon into categories using what the fuck does that say? Our obituary rules and think you can understand them like that. The very idea of a Pokedex revolts me. What do you have to say for yourself? Oh my, looks like you're not my biggest fan. Your opinion is understandable. Happens to be different from mine, which is equally understandable. How about if all people get to decide for themselves how to relate to Pokemon? You're saying I should just allow people to think whatever they want and treat Pokemon however they want, no matter what whether the Pokemon are suffer? I refuse to tolerate the existence of a world like that. Okay. Uh, <laughs> well, I didn't expect him to change his mind right away. Well, I hope he spends his whole time trying to understand how people feel. Well then, I think I'm going to go collect some more data. For Pokemon and people to get along better together, we need to take steps to learn more about them. Hi! Um, Phoenix? I'm gonna go with Professor Jennifer now, because I'm her bodyguard. Alright. Oh, come on! Get out of here! <laughs> oh, shit. Kai is not the good person for this one, anyway. Let's get out of here. It's spring now. Oh, this place looks beautiful in spring. All right, let's heal. So we need some healing. Also, there are the move tutors here, so you can delete, move, like, move tutor, um, yeah, like, stuff like that. So I'm going to see what my boys can learn. Or I don't know if there's any good moves that maybe are locked behind. Let's see. Do you? It's you, right? I call her the Remember Girl. Yeah, yeah, this is one, right? Uh, let's see what Sanji can learn. Maybe there's a move that he had before. Uh, it's fucking spider web. User and creates a target with them so it can't flee from battle. That's. That actually sounds pretty cool if we were dealing with the, the genie Pokemon, so maybe we'll. We'll deal with that, but I don't think, yeah, give up on Sanji. Let's see what another Pokemon can learn. What about Cosmo? Or, uh, yeah, let's do Cosmo first. Maybe there's a better move for him. Confusion, Assurance, no. Uh, let's do Jasper and then we'll, we'll probably quit. What the fuck is a oh, rage? As long as this Pokemon as long as this move is in use, the power of rage increases its attacks that 
after the user is hit in battle. Okay. Okay. I think we're fine. Okay. And then what do you do? Okay. And then that guy, if you have an HM that you want to get rid of off of the Pokemon, that's your guy right there. I do want to check something real quick, because I don't know if I'm confusing it with the second game. I want to see what uh, Iggy can learn. Because I know at least in the second game he can learn Fire, Ice, and Thunder Fang. So I want to see if he can actually learn that in this one. I'm also kind of doing this for my Nuzlocke, because I don't want to get disappointed. So Iggy, don't get comfortable, you're not staying here. <laughs> All right, let's see what uh, Iggy can learn. I was thinking that it would do it, but I don't know. We'll see. Iggy, let's see. No, it's a second game thing. Oh no. Well, shit, I was kind of hoping it wouldn't be. Well, second game we're using Iggy. <laughs> Forget that in the second game they add so many good moves on, on Pokemon. Alright, let's put Iggy back. Hmm. Feel kinda of bad for taking him out. Uh him and Barbie were probably playing cards together and I just like took him out of the game. There you go. Go go play cards again. <laughs> oh yeah, we had poker runs, I forgot about that one. No, no, no. Come on. There we go. Alright. Let's go explore the city now. Actually, now that Sanji's level 30, we can now give him the magnet. Yeah, you don't need that anymore. Now let's get the amulet point. Well, What's the bright powder do? What was the opponent's accuracy? Actually, let's give let's give Cut the extra belt. Oh. Oh hi! I didn't expect the cutscene. Oh hey, Phoenix, right? Let me see your Pokedex for a moment. Uh okay. What do we have here? Oh, you found 67 Pokemon, eh? S staggering. You've seen a clink. You're becoming quite the trainer. Excuse me. I was a bit excited to forgot my manners. My name is Juniper, too. Uh, Cedric Juniper. <laughs> the professor who gave the Pokedex is my daughter. That girl has told me a lot about you. It really makes my day to meet you. In honor of our meeting, I'm going to upgrade your Pokedex. Oh, okay. What would you upgrade it with? So Pokemon can change forms, even though it's the same I individual. If you have already seen a form, you can check it out. I also added the function to make searching easier. Okay. Yes, sir, who's that trainer? Oh, hi, Skyla! Oh, I forgot my introductions. Skyla, this is a friend of my daughter's. Thanks is traveling the internet to complete the Pokedex. Oh, I see. Does that mean you're going to be challenging the gym? Oh, boy, I'm really looking forward to it. That's right, Phoenix. You should challenge this gym. If nothing else, this gym is really out there. See you, Skyla. If anything comes up again, I'll let you know. Professor, my plane is in the cargo plane. It carries cargo, not people. And you're talking as if places like Kanto and Sinnoh are right next- right around the corner. Oh, Skyla, if you keep frowning, your face may freeze like that. And it'd be a shame. People and Pokemon all have to help each other out. See you later! Sheesh. <laughs> Sheesh. I'm sorry. I sort of believe that Hefei go lucky guy like that could be the world renowned for Pokemon professor. Heads up, Phoenix. As a gym leader, I'll be happy to challenge have you challenge the gym, but there's something I need to take care of first. Just now, I was flying the cargo plane and I saw something on top of the Celestial Tower. I'm sure it was a sick Pokemon, and if it is, I can't just leave it there. I have to 
Don't to look into it right away. I'm leaving for Route 7 Celestial Tower if you want to come along, if you want. Okay, I'm gonna lower this in my brain. <laughs> Alright. What do you got? If you have a gym badge of Australian, I'll tell you something cool. Cool cannons. There's a greenhouse on the runway. Freshly picked vegetables can be sent to faraway regions very quickly. Okay. We're doing trading with other. That's pretty cool. I guess that is how we get the moon milk, so. Planes, they're shaded. It's designed to fly. There's no extensive mechanics for flying. What's this? A sky drop! Okay! So basically, you pick up the, the opponent and you just slam them into the ground. I need to turn this on. Hi, buddy. Vegetables grown in the greenhouse are the best. Temperature and their nutrition are all based on uh, something. Uh, <laughs> vegetables grown and completely affect the way it tastes extra, extra delicious. Wait. Oh, okay. Oh, we got a paralyze heal. Okay, there's a lot of items down here. I think it's on the other side. Okay. Max Ether? That's actually really good. Yeah, there's a lot of green out. I like this area, it's really nice. That's what you gotta say. People and Pokemon work together to open to open up the select land to make a place where everyone can live. I'm sorry that this cooperation spirit has remained unchanged. That's nice. Yep, telling us that we can't go in there. What's that? Oh, it's just a tree. It's kind of. I'm sorry about that. <laughs> My finger slipped. So. But anyway, it did look like a Pokemon back there. Let's see. So she said that she was heading to Route 7. So we should probably head there too. This little area. <coughs> now race walkway. If you see it still, you'll fall off, so you gotta keep moving. I will. Hi. Hi. Oh, well, it's to go talk to me, are you? You're quite the trainer, I like you. Take this TM. Let's go. When a Pokemon uses Char Beam, sometimes a special attack will go on. If you're lucky, the power will just keep going up. Alright. What do you have? A bell. I want to go to Celestial Tower, but I got lost and stranded. Bro, you're still on the pathway. I understand that this was a cave, like, but you're, it's not. <sighs> Man, some, some people would be stupid. <laughs> Alright, rock tomb. No, oh, don't, don't. Jasper doesn't like that. Don't like Jasper. Oh no. <laughs> That is not good at all. I didn't think you can get paralyzed from being a ground type. Maybe it just means it's harder to do that. Bro, bro, you gotta stop this shit. Alright, that's it. <laughs> Kai. Kai. Jasper's dying right now. <laughs> Don't stop licking things. That's it. Prancer shell. 
I already have to go back and heal. This is a stupid idiot. Oh, I can't go anywhere if I am stopping. Yeah, no shit. Just turn around. You'll be right back on the road. This is time. Walking on the road, that's right. If you're walking someday, you'll arrive at your destination. Really? <laughs> Let's see what else we gotta do. Which is he? Cause Jasper got his ass kicked. <laughs> I'm so excited because when we get to Celestial Town, we're we'll finally get our sixth party member. He's gonna be a cutie. I'm very, I'm very excited to have a Litwick in my party. I've never used one, surprisingly. I've, I've always used a Myanotan. So I am, I'm, I am excited for that. Let me battle this trainer, and we shall end the episode. I was gonna find more than just strong Pokemon and tall grass. For example, I have found you. <laughs> uh, Trainer Mikey. What do you have? Oh, it's a Dwebble! Cute little guy. What the fuck is this thing weak against again? This is only like water, steel, and rock, right? Yeah, it's rock. <laughs> Jasper, you gotta learn that. You gotta learn Rock Slide. That's a really good move for Jasper, actually. Great. Well, Jasper ain't switching out anytime soon, so. Uh oh. Oh sh. What with the fuck was that a crit? Oh well, I guess Kai, you're water. Don't look at me like that. Yeah. Fuck you. <laughs> Wait, how did how, how did we avoid the attack? Wait. Oh, come on, man. Just, just hit it. Thank you. It's a little crab guy. It does make a cute little noise though. I do like that. <laughs> Of course, this thing's got a fucking semi sage. Alright. Just get out of here. I don't want to look at you. Your hair is weird. Bro! We are not doing good. Actually, you know what? Fuck it. Send Sanji out there. Let's see what Sanji can do against a fucking semi sage. There's, there's a little guy. Oh, you got that. Mm. Alright, let's bug bite it. See what you can do then. <laughs> Fence fell. And that hit pretty hard. It usually are- okay, we're winning this. <laughs> By the, the skin of our teeth, we, uh, we did it. Let's go. Oh, that was all I like Strong, what a traitor! Bro, you just killed all my Pokemon! <laughs> Man! Get out of here. Give me the Ultra Ball. <laughs> we're ending the episode. <laughs> Alright, so we made it through Charge Zone Cave. We are we are clearly, as you can see, we are out of the cave. Um, <laughs> we made it to Mistralian City, and we're gonna head to Celestial Tower just to, to check with uh, Skyla to see what's going on. And hopefully, by next episode, we'll have a little week in our party. So, in the next one, um, that will happen. We'll get we'll get a Litwick. <laughs> we'll get to Celestial Tower. So, but my name is Phoenix, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye bye.